Welcome to this, Ikogawa e-learning module. This module covers the converters for ADMEG AXF magnetic flow meters. When you complete this module, you should have an understanding of the varieties of AXF converters and their LCD displays. Let's start with the various AXF converter types and their specifications. There are two types of converters. One is the integral type which is integrated with an amplifier that generates the electromotive force. The other is the remote type, in which the amplifier is separated from the detector. There are two models of remote converter, the AXF A11 and AXF A14. The AXF A14 is compact in design and suitable for on-site installation. The accuracy and specifications of the AXF A14 are the same as those of the AXF A11. This shows the connection between a remote flow tube and the remote converter. The remote converter applies a necessary excitation current to the flow tube, and flow tube generates an electromotive force. Based on the selected specification, the power supply for the converter can be 100 to 240 volt AC, 100 to 120 volt DC, or 24 volt AC DC. The converter generates current output, with heart or brain communication, as well as pulse output. A standard dual-core cable can be used for the excitation cable as long as it meets the specifications in the figure. Ikogawa's dedicated AXFC cable must be used for the signal cable. The flow signal is transmitted via this dedicated cable. The cable is constructed with double shielding over the two conductors, and heat-resistant vinyl is used for the outer jacket material. The maximum cable length is 200 meters for combined use with the AXF A11 and 100 meters with the AXF A14. Here we can see details of the wiring and terminals of the AXF A14 converter and remote flow tube. Here we can see the same for the AXF A11 converter and remote flow tube. Now let's compare the features of the AXF A11 and AXF A14. Both the AXF A11 and AXF A14 can be used with AXF flow tubes. The AXF A11 can also be used with AXW flow tubes. The AXF A11 can be pipe or wall mounted, whereas the AXF A14 is only pipe mountable. Both the AXF A11 and AXF A14 support the heart and brain protocols, but the AXF A14 also supports foundation field bis and profibus PA. Both models have housing protection that meets the IP66 and IP67 specifications. Let's compare the specifications of the AXF A11 and AXF A14. The AXF A11 supports 7 simultaneous outputs and inputs, versus 3 for the AXF A14. Both of the models have a current output equipped with either heart or brain communications. The AXF A11 can output one pulse and alarm each, but the AXF A14 cannot. The AXF A11 has two status outputs with 11 selectable functions each, whereas the AXF A14 has only one digital output terminal. The AXF A11 has two status inputs with seven selectable functions each, whereas the AXF A14 has only one digital input or output terminal. Let us now see details on the LCD display. The AXF14 has a backlit full dot matrix LCD, 32 by 132 pixels, which can display 1 to 3 lines. It also has 3 infrared switches, which enable users to set parameters without opening the cover. The display of the AXF14 and the integral types can be rotated in 90 degrees increments. The display board can be rotated to plus 90, plus 180, or minus 90 for easy reading. The AXF A11 does not support rotation. Rotation makes it easier to read the values even if the device is mounted vertically or in some other orientation. Magmeters that support the heart or brain protocols have three IR switches, whereas the foundation field bus or profibus PA type magmeters have no switch. The most frequently used 14 parameters among 95 parameters are arranged in a group at the top. General functions can be set by these parameters. The multilingual function supports English, German, French, Italian, 
Spanish, and Japanese. Operating feeling is the same as a mechanical switch. The response region is near the glass to avoid wrong operation. IR switches do not work with dirty gloves on. This picture shows the various selectable displays under operating conditions. Users can select a display by setting a parameter. The one line display shows units and values. The values are displayed in large characters. The two line display shows the values of the same size. The three line display shows a main line with large characters and another two lines with small characters. When the user selects three line, the flow rate, percentage, and total rate can be displayed at one time. This image shows the parameter setting menu when using the IR switches. Alarm displays alternate with the process data as shown. This concludes our module on the converters for ADMEC AXF magnetic flow meters. For more information, or to contact us, please visit our website and official channel on YouTube. Thank you.